Welcome one and all. This, e this evening, it is my pleasure and privilege to convene a special event for the sole purpose of presenting the Loretta McDonald Courage Award. This award goes to an individual who, in the face of physical and mental adversity, has demonstrated extraordinary strength of character, has emerged as an outstanding role model for others, and has touched and inspired all of us. Ladies and gentlemen, this evening we are presenting this award to Katie Bernard of Marlton. Thank you for sharing this special night with me. 
I am humbled to receive this award. For the past nine months, I've been on a journey that I had never imagined that I would have ever taken. I continue to be overwhelmed with the amount of love that I've received. I've received hundreds of cards, pictures of encouragement, donations, sweet treats, the edible arrangements delivery man knows me by name. <laughs> Visits, hugs, and countless prayers. My Cherokee High School family, most especially my Lacoste sisters, have been by my side since the beginning. I will always remember Friday, March 14th. On that day, the entire Cherokee family came together and supported me. I remember as I sat in the hospital, my mom and I crying. <laughs> as we looked at all the pictures of the hundreds of people wearing purple baby shirts, just for me. I looked at my mom and I said, I never knew that that many people cared about me. People often tell me that I'm a strong and courageous person, that I inspire them. I truly do not feel that I am special. Eleanor Roosevelt once said, you have to accept whatever comes, and the only important thing is that you meet it with courage and with the best that you have to give. This is how I live my life. I live every day for the next day, and I give it my best always. Again, thank you for the honor. I appreciate it very much. God bless you, you know, God bless you, all of you, and you know, thank you for coming out.